The rattlesnake has been screwed! Stone Cold's reign as WWE Champion came to a tragic end, and Mr. McMahon's hatred for the Texas Rattlesnake finally reached its boiling point, leaving the boss to search outside of his realm for a suitable ally. I present the higher power. Who could it be? It's me, Austin! Oh, son of a... It was me all along, Austin! You all bought it! Even my immediate family bought it! But what Mr. McMahon forgot was that behind every strong man was an even stronger woman. Dad, Shane, how could you be so cruel? We really weren't trying to hurt you, Stephanie. You see, it's just business. And with the maniacal Mr. McMahon in power, the WWE Board of Directors found that they needed to do business as well, starting with a new CEO. At our next pay-per-view event, which is King of the Ring, it will be me in one corner, and Vince, it'll be you and that little son of yours in the other corner. We take this CEO title of yours. You hang it above the ring, and the only way to reach up and grab it all, Austin, is by climbing a ladder. The ladder match for all the marbles. It's winner take off. Ladies and gentlemen, now entering the ring for tonight's winner take all fighter match from Victoria, Texas, weighing 252 pounds, Stone Cold Steve Austin. The most phenomenal roar I've ever heard in this arena is for the rattlesnake. Good God Almighty, they're on their feet. 20,108, and you're damn right it's personal. My God, can you imagine if tomorrow this guy has control of the WWE? The only thing worse than Stone Cold as champion is Stone Cold as CEO. Well, ladies and gentlemen, here we are. Yes, indeed, the ownership of the WWE is on the line. Hanging high above the ring is that briefcase. With all the goods in it, King, all the paperwork, all that will allow the winner of this ladder match to control World Wrestling Entertainment. And Mr. McMahon said that he's gonna fight tonight, JR. He's fighting for his business. He's fighting for his, his life. McMahon has never had a more desperate, a more serious night. Not from the federal government, not from a lawyer, not from anybody more than he has tonight because McMahon's company is on the line here. And there's the reversal from Shane McMahon, putting the knee to his opponent. Now that's how you hit a DDT. The company is at risk here. The company is at stake. The McMahons could be unemployed in less than 24 hours. The future of the WWE is up in the air. Yeah, up in the air, literally. It's in that briefcase hanging way above the ring. Remember, no disqualifications, no pinfalls. It's all about the case. Winner take all. Yeah, and unfortunately, loser take nothing. Steve Austin doing a great job of turning that around. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Steve Austin. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Give me a break. You've been up to Titan Towers the last week with Stone Cold as the CEO. It's horrible. It's like hell with fluorescent lighting. It's not horrible. I kind of like it. A secretary answering the phone and saying, who the hell is this? That's a disgrace, JR. Well, King, one man's disgrace is a rattlesnake's paradise. He's showing no signs of letting up. Is this it? Incredible move by Steve Austin. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Oh, the velocity, the impact. You could hear it. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Remember, there are no disqualifications in a... Oh, this is a very dangerous situation, JR. Look out! So cool, Steve Austin ladder match against both the McMahons, Vince and Shane, Mr. McMahon oh. and his son, Satan and Satan Jr. This is not right, JR. Mr. McMahon's an executive. He's not made to be put through this, tor this sort of torture. Oh! He is a, a demonic human being in my estimation, and Austin knows that. Austin knows his back is against the wall. The tables could turn at any time. And so could the ladders. Yeah, where's Home ah. Depot when you need it? Clean up on aisle seven. There's some teeth on the floor, I think. And I'm afraid if Mr. McMahon's not careful, there's going to be a spill. No, this is enough, Stone Cold. Oh! Again, it's Shane McMahon being bounced around like a, a rubber ball to anything that's not nailed down. Jerry, you got to look at the look on Stone Cold's face. I think he's actually enjoying this abuse that he's dishing out to the McMahons. Austin loves a great fight. But we know the rivalry between Austin and the McMahon. This is not a fight. It's a total beatdown with weapons, with ladders. This is not fair. Oh, my. So damaging. I'm not sure I can watch this. And he snaps it off. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Austin trying to get even for all those months and months of hell the McMahons have caused the rattlesnake. Well, if Austin wins, the rest of us are in for months and months of hell in the future. Oh, wait, nice reversal. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Well, we're on the move here. The trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. And fools him with the reversal. And the strike connects. Bam! Oh my gosh, big time impact. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Heading to the top rope. Watch out! And he gets leveled. Sometimes all it takes is a basic strike.
Shane McMahon making his statement as we speak. He's in full on attack mode now. Well, we're on the move here. Shane McMahon seems helpless. Steve Austin being pressed hard. Steve Austin being pressed hard. Oh, what a bruising blow with the chair. Sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Austin's in trouble. Textbook snap bear. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Austin spots the opening. Once again, battling right here at our table. Oh, no! Oh, no! A perfect Stone Cold Stunner! Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. Unleashing it for a second time now. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Here we go, back inside the ring. He wants this battle decided inside the ring. Much more of that, and he's not going to last long. It's not going to take. Oh, look at this, JR. Stone Cold up that ladder if he gets there. This thing's over if he can reach that briefcase. Whoa, 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 whoa. Austin trying to retrieve the briefcase. Put the McMahons out of business as far as Shane and, and Mr. McMahon are concerned. It is a two-on-one handicap match. Anything goes. And look at this. Wait a minute. Use the ladder. What's wrong with you guys? Oh, that's not going to work. That's not exactly uh, astute ingenuity. What's next for these morons? He's these are supposed to be business geniuses. And now look at this. Well, they're in dire straits. They're in an emotional situation. Well, they needed a couple of pairs of big shoes. They might take two clowns in there. Uh-oh, uh-oh, Austin's up. This is not gonna be good. Somebody's going down. Uh, Somebody's going down. Bam! Oh! Mr. McMahon and his son Shane knocked down Austin with, a, with an opportunity now. Oh, stutter! Oh, man. The stunner. 
And then another stunner oh. on Shane O'Mac. Okay, the Rattlesnake has a clear path to victory now. Austin sets the ladder, makes sure it's sturdy. All Austin has to do now is get up that ladder. Any second, look at this, JR. Stone Cold is climbing the ladder. Wait a minute. The, the, the briefcase is ascending, as is Austin. Austin's no physical way to reach the briefcase. What's going on here? I have no idea, but that briefcase is going up down like a yo-yo. You gotta be kidding me. There is collusion here. Austin knows something is screwy. I don't think that's the guy in charge of that. We certainly don't have anything to do with it. Vincent Man, Vincent Man going to the top. He's the, reaching for the briefcase. And the briefcase is lowering. Uh-oh, now and Stone Cold. Oh. Austin up on the, on the ladder, the briefcase is, is rising a little bit. We get out of Austin's reach. Shane O'Mac kicked back down. Oh, Austin going for it, but now Vince just hammering away at Austin. And look at Shane. Look at Shane. Shane pushing the ladder. Ah! And both his daddy and the rattlesnake go down. Shane McMahon has an opportunity. Can he seize the moment? Can Shane McMahon seize the moment he's for the, the McMahon family? He's got that ladder set up. Shane climbing to the top of the ladder. And look at the briefcase. It's lowering down what into the, his grasp. Where the hell's Houdini? <laughs> David Copperfield. Shane's got it. And the McMahons have retrieved the briefcase. They have won the ladder match. Here are your winners, Shane McMahon and Mr. McMahon. And there's no doubt in my mind that Austin's life will now become even more of a legend.